kick off. Both teams in traditional colors, sun is shining, and we're off and running. Cyrus Christie immediately tests Kepa Ariza Balaga with a low shot from the edge of the box. Chelsea's first break forward, with Hazard, via Kavakic, finds Espilicueta, but his cross is blocked. Moments later, a similar counter leads to Kent charging into the Fulham box, laying it to Pedro, who takes the ball inside and passes it beyond Sergio Rico. Fulham corner, after Antonio Rudiger can only slice across behind. They take it short, Johansson swings it in, but David Luiz heads clear. Back it comes, towards the head of Alexander Mitrovic, but again Chelsea stand firm. Crisp game, this, but not too frantic and without too many errors in possession. Eden Hazard is still warming up, he produces a neat back heel to Pedro on the edge of the box, but Fulham have tightened up a bit since that early goal. Kavakic and Gerald share a 1-2 end, for a moment. It looks like Christie has clattered into the Serbian in the box, but he won the ball in the air first. Chelsea now enjoying plenty of unfettered possession on the halfway line, as Fulham retreat further. Sari's going mildly nuclear about something, Kant's probably half a yard out of position for a goal kick or something, but he should be fairly satisfied with the opening quarter of this game. We're still yet to see Giroud click into gear as Chelsea's deluxe targetman, though. Meanwhile, Callum Chambers gives Ariza Balaga something to do from 25 yards. Marco Salonzo still finding his crossing range from the left, and has squandered a couple of presentable chances to find Giroud in the middle. No bother, though, because Chelsea instead weave a few lovely passes on the edge of the Fulham box before Kant's shot is blocked. Magical stuff, for a moment. Gerard finally gets the ball in the danger zone, thanks to Hazard's perception, but he's driven wide and Sergio Rico is out to block. Goal kick. Hazard is momentarily in behind the Fulham defence, but Dennis O'Doy gently wrestles him to the ground, free kick. David Luiz takes charge of it, 30 yards out but it's deflected behind for a corner. Chelsea go short, but it's wasted. First half petering out a little, despite Cape's best efforts to worsen Chelsea fans' blood pressures by holding on to the ball until the very last moment, right in front of his own goal line. Christie gifts the ball to Gerard, who can't capitalize by scooping the ball over for Kavakic. Chelsea regather, though, and Gerard meets a low cross at the near post. Rico smothers, corner. Chelsea continue to find very promising positions, but still can't get a shot away. Hazard is the latest culprit, but that pressure will surely tell again soon. Brilliant attacking persistence from Chelsea finally releases as Pilacuita to the byline, and Gerard just fails to poke the ball beyond Rico from five yards. Half time can't come quickly enough for the visitors. Hazard has been at the center of everything, Giorgino has enjoyed a little more freedom than he had against Spurs, and the defense has had little to worry about. And, still, it's just 1 0. Half time, Chelsea 1 Fulham 0. 1 0 to the hosts, but it ought to have been more, given the overwhelming pressure they've put on Fulham. But shots win prizes, and they haven't really had enough of them to extend their lead.